How's it going today, folks? It's Future LGS here. We got a double dose of Metazoo today. Um, unless we, you know, hit something crazy in the first box and maybe there's no use for the second box. I don't know. I, I kind of doubt it, but I don't know. I don't kind of doubt it. I really doubt it. Because everyone believes that this uh, this product is a dumpster fire. Ah, this is uh, very stubborn. So, we're going to talk about why I like this product. We talked a bit, a little bit about it last set, and I really, honestly, think that it's because I personally believe that Prismora is overpriced. Um, it's a great card, but bottom line, at least as far as I know, it's not reserveless, right? I don't think so. Um, and if it was reserveless, it would have every right to be as expensive as it is, if not more expensive. But, at least they have not yet, but I personally believe they will, and several times over, reprint it. Um, oops, those are going to go there. Um, and so therefore, why are, why are people paying so much for Prismora? I mean, like, yeah, you need it, you need two of them to play. I will admit, in most instances, they are very. It's a very strong card. So if you're playing the game, but no, like, look, I'm not gonna say no one's playing, but not as many people play as you think. For as high as this was a print run, ooh, that's a pretty card. Right, that will go here actually. Um, I I just I just don't agree with it. I mean, like, I know people are paying for it, and maybe it's evil investors or whatever are. Um, doing something sneaky with it. I, I just don't, I just don't really agree with it. Um, we're going to stop looking at the back card, I think. I think we're just going to look at the front. And the, I, I don't, I'm not 100% sure, but, oh, I, I thought it was something spicy. Um, I think this is where the golden ticket is. I haven't watched, ugh, I hate that. Um, I don't think anything can show up in these cards. At least not spicy. Obviously there's cards that show up there, but. Um, anyways, folks, uh, overall, I think that MetaZoo is a very strangely priced, I said I was going to be done looking at those, and yeah, I can still look at them. Um, a very strangely priced thing. As some products release, they're like, oh, hey, this product is good. Goes up. Very quickly. Very quickly. Oh, I thought it was another hollow, and I was like, really? Um... And then they just plummet. Or the product goes out, it's like moderately priced, and then it just goes up for no reason. Um, sometimes I think that's because it's the print run. Um, I'm looking at you eBay Wilderness boxes. But, ooh, nice, awful, great. That's uh, I think that's like a $4 card. So, you know, not amazing, but it's something, right? Um, it's not that playable, playable of a card, but it is. I, I do believe it's a beautiful card. Um, and it might go up over time, but I don't think it's very powerful in general. Ooh, an Iowa Dragon, nice. Um, but... I, I just, I can't stress enough that I just don't think that this is an, um, like... And this is probably me being crazy... Be in the, the future of LGS. I, I, I think these are at least... I don't want to say a $200 box, but at least MSRP box. Like, with what can come in these, like, I just don't see it. Like, how are these... How are these cheaper than Wilder... Or than... I don't know. I, I know the print run is more, so there's double of them and all that jazz. But, like, the fact that you can get... Oh my gosh, we pulled like three of those in this box. Uh, a golden ticket, and I don't even remember what a golden ticket reveals, uh, re redeems for off the top of my head. I know it's uh, just crazy stuff. Um, watch we pull a golden ticket in this video. That'd be unreal, folks. But I just, I don't know. I, I don't think that Wilderness, I think Wilderness gets a bad rap for being an ugly set. Just because the print run is a lot. I, I don't remember if they said UFO is the same amount or if it, UFO is more. I know it's at least 100k for UFO. 
Wow, we just, oh, that's another duplicate hollow. That's kind of strange. But, let's put some more of these over here. Uh, folks, I, I also just want to say I appreciate the people who are watching this that have supported me over time. Um, and I know I don't get, you know, two million bajillion views or whatever. Um, but I appreciate the people that have stayed nice, hateful demise. Um, stay subscribed and watch my videos and, um, I don't want to say, like, support my content because I don't have, like, a Patreon or anything, but, like, more or less support it. I mean, like, it is nice to have the consistent people that watch, so I, I just, just so you know, I do appreciate you, um, as always, but. Oh, I, I, I had a good feeling about that, but I, I was like, I knew I saw Hollow. Um, you know. I just thought about this. Put it in the comments if you guys want me to open Crypto Nation 2nd Edition. Because, you know, I miss box toppers. Look at that. That's like, what? That's so weird. We just pulled that like two times ago. Alright, can we get a can we get a green man? Can we get a green man? Please? 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 Do I just have to complain? Be like, oh, MetaZoo sucks. And, oh, this game is awful. And... No one pulls it, and it's going to zero, and... Oh, uh, what if... What if... I was... They knew I was kidding. They knew it. The cryptids know when you're lying. They do. I don't know how, but I really do think that this game is... I don't know. Oh, okay. I was like, wait, is that in the wrong order? Um, I don't want to say it's going to the moon, because I don't really think it's... I think that, ah, ah, I just hurt my funny bone, folks. That hurt a lot, actually. I don't want to say that the game is going to the moon or anything like that, but I, I do think that it has a lot of work to do before, we pulled another one of those earlier. Oh, hey, look, another one. Oh, lovely. I, I actually, not, I got to think about this, but... I don't know if, um, one of the reasons why I think that people hate this so much, hate wilderness so much, is because of, that's a rare, right? Yeah, that's a rare. So the fact that you can get rares as a non-hollow, yeah, some people like it, but what is that, like maybe 5% of people like that? Uh, every time I see Germanite, I think of growth, and I'm like, oh, wait, oh, no, it's not a good card. Because growth is really good, but that's Cryptonation, not this. Oh, my, this is the third one of those we've pulled, which is actually really funny. Because this is the same box. I'm, like, almost positive we pulled three of those in this box, all the ones I'm talking about. Oh, oh, I mean, at least we're doing better on the hollows, but they ain't good hollows, if you know what I mean. Like, I would, I mean, like, we, well, we got, like, a couple, um, not sigils, but, um, dang, a lot of hollows. But, uh, we'll get into the second box soon, and hopefully we'll get a prism or a nope. Oh, gosh. I just, I, re I realized we, we started talking off about prism aura, and we have gotten clobbered in this box. Um, kind of funny, but. Kind of not funny because I just don't appreciate the lack of Prismore. We need a Prismore, folks. I need it. I need it. I need it. Oh, got excited there for a second. All right, folks. Um, last pack in this box. This box has been awful. And we got another duplicate. And I hate it. Um, yeah. That was ugly. Hopefully, some box two can redeem us, but I kind of doubt it. Um, so, for those of you who are keeping track, um, that's three boxes. Um, if this goes in, goes live sequentially, and that's no prison wars. This is not how I remember this going. <laughs> um, I remember there being a prison war in not every box, but most boxes. And then I think I, I swear we got two prison wars in one box. And, I mean, it's just like Mothman. Like, I think we got three 
Three Mothman in one box. Um, full hollow in a second edition box. It wasn't a first edition box. So it wasn't like, oh my gosh. Jeremy, you're lying. You're full of crap. But it's just... It seems to me that when I really want it and really hope for it, I get nothing. So maybe I should just stop expecting, you know, crazy things to happen. Um, I don't know. Because I feel like... It's kind of funny when I opened the red ink, and for those of you guys who don't know, I have pulled a red ink, I have pulled a blue ink. Um, we kind of like to chase expensive Mezu cards here on this channel, mostly. Um, I've pulled some alright stuff from other card games, but um, Mezu seems to be where our, our luck is, and no, I wouldn't say where my passion is, but it's definitely where most of my luck has been. Um, I, I feel like I wasn't expecting to pull the red ink, especially, and if you go back and look at that video. <laughs> I, I, I wasn't that excited, but not because I wasn't excited. Yeah, Mishu Peshu. Um, was because it was, I think it was like midnight when I recorded that video and I was trying not to wake people up and I was just like, I was more speechless than I was like um, amazed. It's kind of funny, but I don't know. You'd think I'd be more excited. Like if I pull Green Man here or Golden Ticket, pretty sure I'll scream. You might want to turn your headphones down if 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 that happens. I kind I mean, obviously, I doubt it'll happen because we don't. We seem to have used that luck up. Um, we opened Nightfall and never really got much. We opened what so much Wilderness already, even before these videos went live. Um, and my luck just seems like it's gone. It's kind of strange. Um, we got a jellyfish. Um, honestly, I don't, I don't think anyone's really opening this anymore, which is part of the reason that I think it's kind of strange that, like, we haven't had any hype around this set. Because, like, I don't even think we know what all the tickets are used for. Which is just, like, like, folks, like, do you not want to, do you not want to know, like, what the rest of this is for? It's just, it kind of blows me away, honestly. Another awful? Okay, okay. I mean, like we said a little bit earlier, it's not the best card, but it's, I mean, it's sleeve worthy. Um, it's kind of funny how it, it does trigger me, folks, to not sleeve these. I will say that. Um, because you never know what could be worth more money in the future. For now, we're going to Wild 7. But, like, that is a great card. Like, it really is. Like, the fire deck someday is going to be spicy. And those are going to be running it. That kind of fire deck. I shouldn't say, like, fire is decent already, I think. But, and again, the Iowa Dragon. It's a good card, too. Uh, folks, um, I don't really know what to say else. Um, I do think that overall Wilderness is underpriced. It's either Wilderness is overpriced or Prismora is overpriced. Wait, seafood barbecue. Um, what did I say? Um, wilderness is overpriced or no, wilderness is underpriced. I'm sorry, folks. Wilderness is underpriced or Prismora is overpriced. And I, I personally think it's Prismora is overpriced. But, um, yeah, I think that's about it. Should we just close it and say, you guys aren't watching the rest of these. I'll just open it. No, I'm just kidding. I am just kidding, folks. We're going to open them because, you know, what if there is something spicy in here? I got to record it if there is. Um, I I don't know why. Like, another reason that I really enjoy this channel um, and doing this stuff for you is because it is fun to just watch stuff and have my, have my openings recorded. Like, it's fun to just kind of rip cards and talk to you guys. Uh, shoosh. Uh, but... It would be nice to pull at least one prism off. Um, folks, I, uh, I don't like, darn it, darn it, not pulling the prism aura. The prism aura, please. We need a prism aura. Or a green man. Green man! Oh, what if that would have been green man? What if, folks? Just kidding. Should we play Rip It or Rick It or I don't even know what it's called. Rip It or Ship It or no, it's it's Rip It or something. And the answer is 
new because I would be very upset. Oh, I thought that was something special, but it's not. Um, if that was like a green man or a golden ticket, I don't. I think a golden ticket would be fine because I don't think the golden ticket. I think they would just redeem the golden ticket anyway. Turbo check, cheap sensor hollow. You know what would be really cool is if they had like a really rare Terra. That would be super cool. And I bet they'll do that eventually. Like a Terra that is like a secret rare or something like that. That like you can only play in like a very good deck or something like that. That would be really cool. Alright folks, so, so far we have, I believe... The Mishu Peshu and the Awful in this box. Um, about the same hollows. Um, the last box, I think we got the most hollows out of the four boxes that we pulled. But they haven't. They weren't really good. And honestly, folks, uh, we don't get a Prismore uh, very soon. That might be the last Wilderness box we opened for a while. Because <laughs> I am uh, getting my clobbered uh, very badly. Wow. Wow. That's all I can say, folks. That is all I can say. What? Oh. I gotta, like, after this, I, folks, I, on the next video, I am going to try to remember to look up what the golden ticket slot is in because I... I'm really scared that I'm like throwing it away in these top like seven cards or whatever. Come on, something spicy. I mean, that's that's cool. I mean, it's one of my favorite cards in the set. It's a cool card. I mean, I will say it's sleep worthy because it's like I think it's like I think it's like seven bucks too. In the days that these were like I think they were like twenty five before the big tournament, but it is a very strong card in my opinion. Very cool card. I love that it has 55 health, which is very relevant in a lot of situations in MetaZoo, at least in my days. Wampus Cat. Um, you know what card I really wanted to be good, and um, if we have a little bit of time, um, I will go through its big... Uh, I guess I'll just go through it while we're talking. It's Big Bird, and Big Bird is a card that costs 7, and it would cost 5, if cat or not cat, um, bird could be on the fourth wall list, and I was like, you know, that'd be kind of cool. It kills on the flying. I'm like, that's that's not terrible. And then I'm like, oh, bird can't be a fourth wall effect, which you know it kind of makes sense. But there's just so many things that like, if they could be worth fourth wall, that would be good. Okay, folks, we got one pack. We're gonna we're gonna do something fun. Okay, that's upside down like I want it. Okay, so we're just gonna do this. I gotta flip I gotta do this right though. This card is gonna be the golden ticket. Isn't it? Oh nope. Nope. So this is the rare regular rare. Oh my gosh, folks, it's a rare. Oh my gosh, folks, it's not a rare. Well, folks, that's four boxes. No Prismora. Um, we got destroyed. So, but thanks for watching, folks. Appreciate the um the support, and hopefully next time we get a Prismora, or we get a Green Man, or we get a Golden Ticket. Um, yeah, thanks, folks. Bye. Have a, see you in the future.